Welcome back to Logic Pro 10 Beginners Course. DJ Vic Vapor with you. And let's take a an additional look at our MIDI editing options, specifically the keyboard. Let's go over the fact that now you can see on the left here, the keyboard's indicating where the notes are being played. Of course, you know, C3, C2, and you can scroll down all the way to C minus 2 and all the way up to C8, probably up to G, somewhere in there. But let's say you just want to look only at the notes that you have in your arrangement within the MIDI clip. There's a couple ways to actually get rid of, because it's easy to get lost on this piano roll, and you know it's quite large, and it's easy to kind of like lose your position here. So one of the things you can do is go up here to this collapse mode. We click this. It's only going to, it's going to collapse or in some DAWs it's referred to as fold, but it's going to put all the MIDI notes into an arrangement and it's only going to give you the ones that you're working with. So you can see every line here has a note on it because it's only the notes that we're working with. So I can go in and still move these around and do whatever I want to do, but now I'm not lost on the piano roll. I'm within the notes and the structure that I originally put in. So there's a you can zoom in and zoom out, hold command down and use your arrow buttons. It'll get, get tight, wide, different views, just like before with other features. We can go left or right, and that's holding command and the arrow buttons. And another shortcut is to just click somewhere in the open area and hit Z on your keyboard. That'll zoom in, zoom out, and give you those close-up and uh, easy-to-work-with um, views. So that's the piano roll and the um, ability to kind of zoom in zoom out and you, you also have your different tool features here that are specific to the med MIDI editing just like in the audio there might be a few different features here but again you've got editing tools and as long as we've got this bottom section highlighted we've got all our keyboard shortcuts available to us as well so Let's move on to the next lesson and let's look at uh, score editing.